What I know about scotch wouldn't fill a wee dram. That's what you call a little glass of scotch in Scotland. That's why I headed to the Highland Stillhouse, an authentic Scottish pub, where the owner, Mick, agreed to distill his vast knowledge of whiskey and scotch for me. Mick, I asked you kind of a question I was worried would sound kind of dumb, but what's the difference between whiskey and scotch? You know, all uh, scotch is whiskey, but not all whiskey is scotch. Really? So a whiskey is a distilled spirit made from grain. Uh, whereas Scotch whiskey, especially single malts, are made primarily from barley. And they all come from Scotland if they're Scotch, right? That's right. Gotcha, gotcha. I have to ask, because of all the bottles behind you, how many whiskeys do you have here? Well, we have about 180 Scottish single malts, but then we have a large selection of American whiskeys, even some uh, Japanese whiskeys. Whoa! Uh, so some from all over the world. Obviously, I don't know that much about whiskey. If I wanted to start, where would you start me? Well, I would probably start with a little taster, not to be presumptuous and uh -huh. think that you wouldn't like a big smoky whiskey. This, you can really smell the smoke in this. You might like something very light and caramely and smooth. Okay, I have to admit, I kind of like this one a little better. Does that make me girly? No, not okay. at all. <laughs> People might not know if they've only had the bad whiskey, you can actually sip these. You, you don't need to mix them with anything, Absolutely. right? Absolutely. And it's really about drinking better things and drinking less of them. I have to say, even though you said drink less of it, I kind of want you to fill up that other glass there. <laughs> Mick holds organized tastings about once a month, but if you go into the Highland Still House and mix there, chances are he'll pour you a wee dram. And now you know what that is. For BDX TV Reports, I'm Chloe Hauser. Back to you.